So hey, uh, in this video, we'll be uh, talking about a minor minor bug, not actually bug, a error, how you can solve it. You might get this error. Uh, I mean, I have heard about this error, but I have never got this error. But to, to, today I got this error, so thought of making a video on it. So uh, when you are working with the MongoDB, you uh, when you are starting a server, there might be an issue where your uh, Mongo will say that, okay, your the reason could be you try to access a database from an IP, which isn't a whitelisted. So it is actually known as like a white, yeah, I mean, Mongo whitelisting IP, I, I mean, IP issue. So uh, I got this error recently, uh, I mean, to, today itself so make sure it will take that uh, it will tell you that make sure your current ip address is or uh, is your at last cluster ip whitelisted okay and you can just visit your that uh, that particular security i think the documentation that doesn't cover that issue i mean uh, specifically that what to take uh, the but yeah we will look into how to solve and these are all the all the details of the error but we will look into how to deal with it. So uh, in your cluster, in this, I mean, this will be, will be your, I mean, the, the project. And on the right, on the left side, you will see the network access, okay? So in, in when you, you, you click on the network access, this is my current IP, right? So what you can do is you can either edit and then set your IP again, or what you can do is allow access from anywhere and uh, you can just give it, give the IP like maybe 0. Point, okay, I have to edit this. Yeah. So from anywhere, if you click uh, access from anywhere that you can just either give 0. 0. 0. 0.0.0 then slash zero and then confirm and you can just confirm this and it will load some, some time for some time. And will keep you pending. So once it is active, you can just your issue will be solved. Okay, but let's say you don't want this to be an API. I mean, you don't actually want this to be zero point zero point zero. I mean, you don't want for now. You don't want this uh, to be accessible to anyone this uh, this cluster but what you can do after you set to 0 .0 .0, 0.0.0 you can just re reset it with your current ip okay so this is my current ip again and you can just confirm it again, okay so if you reserve it your issue will be solved so now i have resaved it again yeah, this is now active so now if I see this, my here my server is started. And you will see this is also starting. The my disk cluster is also working. And if I just enter this and then server will start. Yeah, my server started, right? But before it was giving me like uh, like errors and all. So there are two two things that you you, you, you can do you, either you can set the IP to 0.0.0, .0 or else you can just simply set the re, reset the your IP from the network tab. I mean the the network access tab. Okay, so yeah, this was uh, all about this video.